The Levex technologies are made up of several core technologies. First, the time-tested passive permanent magnet suspension system, which provides levitation requiring zero energy input. The next piece is the permanent magnet eddy current drive system. This frictionless propulsion system can be combined with any fuel source or energy storage system. The propulsion system provides primary braking forces for the operation of the carriage, but we've also developed separate frictionless non-contact linear brakes to assist with stopping heavy loads. When packaged together, these core technologies create Levix transportation systems that are innovative, ecologically sustainable, and resource efficient. It took a lot of consideration to decide whether to move to the passenger market or the freight market as our initial product development. We found niche market demand for freight systems that can operate between marine terminals and intermodal facilities or marine terminals and truck hubs, situations where the linkage by heavy existing rail does not exist. We had worked with the ports of Los Angeles and Long Beach for about two years in a proposal process examining alternatives for zero emission container freight moving systems. At the end of that process, the ports requested technology developers provide large-scale demonstrations of their technology at work under full load. Today, I believe we're the only participant in that process that has moved ahead with a full-scale, full-load freight demonstration. The Levix freight demonstration located in Port Angeles, Washington, has been loaded with approximately 70,000 pound payload We've used Jersey Barrier concrete blocks, each weighing 3,800 to 4,000 pounds to simulate that load. What the demonstration system proved for us was that the technology is completely scalable from the small passenger systems that we demonstrated early on to this heavy-duty freight system. All of our systems are designed to maintain that one inch minimum air gap between the carriage and the guideway. And all of our systems have been engineered with a propulsion requirement of about one pound of forward force per each thousand pounds of carriage and payload weight.